<laughs> my name is Keto. I'm 37. We are standing in front of my house in South Brooklyn and we are about to go on an adventure. Three and a half years ago, I came out to myself as being trans between genders or where gender just sort of doesn't apply. The beach came in a similar time and the beach has been really important for me. I'm in a really big community of queer and trans artists. The queer community is like a web of people who question the world as we know it and are not afraid to think outside of that and work actively towards those dreams. I just got back from teaching for a week in the woods with like 40 queer youth who are surviving the shelter systems. I've had my own struggles with being in and out of like having homes over the last couple of years. Their situations are so much more intense than anything that I was ever experiencing and yet it feels nice to like be in a position in my life I guess where I can help ex-homeless youth. Okay, so we're getting to my favorite part of the drive. Yay! As you drive down Flatbush Avenue and L turns into M, which turns into P, which turns into S, and it goes from being like really congested, you feel like the air starts to lighten and there's a little bit of extra like salty moisture to the air. Yeah, we're going to the beach. It makes this really beautiful noise as you go over the bridge. It's singing. We are now in the Rockaways. Here we are. It's 10.30 at night. We are on a very quiet block, and so it makes these beaches incredibly private, which to me makes them feel like sanctuary. And I like to come here at night when I can actually just be alone with the ocean or just really unobserved or unhurried by time. It's calming. At night here, it's completely empty. It's just you. Is the sound of the wind, this like mushy feeling of wet sand beneath your toes, it's like a black and white photograph come to life. The world is a complicated place and it's tough to be queer sometimes. A sanctuary is a place where you can find respite from that and being out here on the beach does that. How we move into a world that more closely resembles our dreams is a really important process. I think a sanctuary is a place where that kind of dreaming can happen. I just removed my shoes. Now I'm walking on the sand. I'm rolling up my pants. <laughs> Smoking a cigarette with my feet in the ocean is one of the greatest pleasures in life. It's kind of really nice.